Lurgan itself is quite a divided town uh, and has become more so even since the Good Friday Agreement and the peace process has begun. Uh, and very often the young people in the town don't actually just get an opportunity to meet. So the essence of the shared education programme is to creating that opportunity. In this particular project, it's been important to allow the children to see how they feel in different spaces in the town, right from the extremes of you know um, what's traditionally a Protestant background or what's maybe a Catholic background towards the more shared spaces in the town, and allow them to see how they feel and how each other feels in those different spaces. I'm feeling quite comfortable at the chapel here. I'm feeling okay, I'm feeling grand, just it's afternoon time in the housing state. At 10pm on Saturday night I would feel mm, not really, feel uncomfortable either. I would say I do feel comfortable in my town, but I think that's just because I'm always in my like area of like the divide, I never really am in the other side of town. There's not that many no-go areas in town. I wouldn't consider any areas that I wouldn't go to in Lurgan. Maybe it would feel a little bit more uncomfortable around certain times of the year. Places I wouldn't feel comfortable would probably be down the road in this housing state, down in a Kilwilkie area. More of the IRA memorials and the murals and all that there, I wouldn't feel entirely safe there. There's definitely a few that I wouldn't want to be at 10 o'clock on a Saturday night. Like, I think, park, I would never want to be there alone. We hope to achieve with this project that the pupils would be able to see, as they went round today and they've taken the survey, that there is across the board a variation of how they feel at the different places and to identify that it's okay that in certain parts some people may feel uncomfortable, but when they identify that, to actually start to make steps forward and going, right, how do we change this? How do we make a difference? If I had to change anything, it would definitely have to be taking down flags. I'd like my town to be more uh, inclusive and everyone being able to tolerate each other. What I would like to see in my town is a bit more unity. There is still a wee bit of a divide and it's just not needed. It's been an eye-opener, really. I am just seeing how people felt. Uh, where I felt comfortable and how they felt. It's been very positive and it's good to hear different people's opinions on different places in town. Enjoyed it. Um, it's been fun. It's nice mixing with it with the other school. I think it's just a good way to like bond with people. Being involved in this survey is all about creating that opportunity for them to have a different narrative when they're growing up, so that their experience growing up even in a, a town and a society that's still divided, is one where they are interacting, where they're meeting, where they're doing so from a young enough age that it forms their attitudes and experiences early on. When you give them that opportunity to meet, uh, as we've seen today yet again, they just get on really, really well. And it's really just about creating those chances and then letting the young people do what they will do, which is just hang out and chat and make friends.